Okay, cuties, I got an unboxing for you. This time, I purchased them in the store. Go with me on a journey. Also, too, as well, I got a funny story to go along with this. So, they came in this bag. It's a Gucci bag. Recyclable Gucci bag? Huh? Guess I could use it for groceries. Anywho, you already see the stripes. If you know, you know. So these are a pair of sneakers from the Gucci and Adidas collab. Now, I do like this box. It's a really, really nice box. So as I unbox these, I'm gonna tell you how I bought a pair of these sneakers last year, pre-release, right? I had access. I bought a pair and the pair that I bought when I got them, they were way too big. I got them true to my size, but it was way too big. So I had to return them. Because they were a pre or not a pre-order, because they were a pre-sale, um, yeah, you could not exchange. You could only buy one, one time, and that's it, regardless of what happened. So I got them through Adidas. I had to return them. And like I said, they gave me my money back, but then that's it. So then I was blown. So then Babe had an account with Access. So I bought a pair through his account, shipped those out, and guess what? Laser ship stole them. So Adidas gave me my money back. And then I had no sneakers. Now, here's what's funny. When I got the first pair, I did an unboxing for you. I was ready to show you and everything. Matter of fact, take a look at this real quick. Okay, so I bought them, <laughs> returned them, did not get them again. But I was stalking out. So both Adidas and Gucci sell them. So as you see, I ended up buying them from Gucci. But they had a new color and new styles. So the original pair I got were pink, as you saw. And they were kind of like a velour kind of material. And they were cute. And then I was like, okay, let me move on. So then I fell in love with the yellow pair. It's like a mustard gold, marigold color. And they were like satin. Didn't have them in my size. Buzzkill. This tissue paper is cute. So, fell in love with another other. And this time, they had them in my size. Now, the first time I checked for them, they didn't have them in my size. Also, too, as well, I wasn't exactly sure what size I needed after getting the first pair and they were way too big. I did call and ask questions and they kind of gave me a general idea of, shoe bag, of what size I would probably need. And then I went with that. And so I went in the store and tried them on when I saw they had them in stock to make sure that they were what I wanted and desired and in the right size. So this time, third time is a charm all right it's just tissue paper in this box and some red gucci shoelaces all right i do like the boxing for sure each shoe is in a gucci adidas shoe bag we'll definitely be using these for packing in the future okay so outside of that one i guess we might as well do them both at the same time at the same damn time then they come in another shoe bag Ooh, they're gold. I'm a sucker for a good metallic. They are a gazelle, which is a traditional style for Adidas. And they have, they have other colors. They have other textures. They even come in a platform. The platform is way too rubbery. The sole part is for me. I wasn't feeling it. But they did have the classic uh, G Gucci print in a gazelle. And it was a flat platform and it had a multicolored platform, that shit was dope. Didn't have it in my size. Anyway, <laughs> so let's see. This is just the regular Gucci tag. You see the Adidas three stripes, the gold, the Adidas and Gucci on the back and black and gold, red laces, which is interesting because it's got red laces in here. I guess they wanted you to have an extra pair. So let's take this out. It just says Gucci. I'm sure that's all it says. Remove only after sale. Hmm. All right. Some stuffing. This is more like tissue. It feels more like tissue than actual tissue paper. All right. The inside says Gucci, the brand with the three stripes. 
of course, made in Italy. And then here, you can see the tongue a little bit. So it says Gucci. And then it's just, you know, got all their markings on it. It's like a rubbery. I don't know if you, you can kind of see the texture. You can tell it's not fabric. So it's kind of like a rubbery material. Very nice, very nice. And the bottom is the Adidas and Gucci logo, which is pretty dope. I like them. I like them a lot. So I wear a women's eight. I typically wear a men's six and a half. Gucci sizing is interesting. <laughs> so these are a five plus, which I believe is a men's five and a half. This is a men's shoe, a men's five and a half. So they are a whole size smaller than a typical men's size that I wear. They look long. They're not very long. Like I said, I wear women's eight. They are spectacular. I look forward to doing great, 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 great things with them. You already know. On the side, can you see it? You can see it. It says Gucci and then it's got the Adidas. I like that they went to great lengths to combine both logos in every aspect of the shoe. I think that's really, really dope. And you know, Italian. Yes, darling, I finally got them. <laughs> I know, it took me three tries. The nerve of these people. Gucci ain't let me down, though. All right. I got to go. Because we got somewhere to go in these fly-ass shoes. New nickname, Michael Johnson. If you don't know, Google it. Until next time, cuties. Bye.